up is Gary Atenzi with CNTV, and I'm here with Frankie Sanchez at Champions MMA and Fitness in Parker, Colorado. Brand new gym, bringing some great things for the uh, city of Parker. I'm here with Frankie. Frankie, tell me a little bit about what you're bringing here to Parker. Well, you know, it's it's um, just a mixed martial arts gym. Uh, mixed martial arts, of course, as you know, is the fastest growing sport in the world. So we decided to bring it down to Parker because there's a lot of interest down this way. You know, we're sitting within um, some of the top wrestling schools in the state, Ponderosa, Chaparral, uh, you got Cherokee Trail, you got Cherry Creek. So we decided to bring this to this area, but not only for the mixed martial arts because it's a great workout. We have uh, Parker is known for a family um, community, so we wanted to bring it to this community because a lot of people have interest in it. Fantastic. When you say about a family community, what kind of age group are we looking at that's going to be able to come to the gym here? You know, we're looking at anywhere from as long as you can walk, we're here. I train, I train students from uh, ages 3 all the way up to 70 years old. So, uh, you know, we, um, we want all comers to come. We believe that health and fitness is um, very important in everyone's lives. So, um, you know, anywhere, if they can walk, they can come here. So not only is it a unique sport because you have to actually have a real good balance between a little bit of everything, but I imagine as far as using that to get in shape, it's got to be amazing. Oh, you know, um, ESPN did a, uh, did a uh, research a few years ago, and they um, took all the sports, combined them together. They had scientists see which was the most cardiovascular, which was the most muscle use, and believe it or not, boxing was the top one on that. So um, when you talk about workouts, um, you know, um, boxing is by far one of the best cardio workouts that you can do. Fantastic. Let's give me kind of an overview of uh, what you envision here to be bringing. Well, you know, we go anywhere from um, CrossFit, which is um, a big craze. Uh, CrossFit is, you know, a mixture of doing um, lunges, squats, pull-ups, uh, using kettlebells. Uh, just uh, that's that's one of the most well-known. Um, exercises right now we're gonna have CrossFit we're gonna have karate as a discipline we want to teach kids and and um, adults that uh, you know the discipline of karate is still there and it still works for you karate's worldwide and it's been there for hundreds and hundreds of years so we're gonna have karate uh, we're gonna have Brazilian jiu-jitsu Brazilian jiu-jitsu is uh, one of the fastest growing sports because of the Gracie family in Brazil and um, the, a lot of them are coming to, to um, the United States to, to have school, so we're going to have jiu-jitsu, we're going to have boxing, which has been around for years, and we're going to have wrestling for youth and adults, uh, boxing for youth and adults, cardio kickboxing classes, so we're going to have a mixture of it all. Now, let me ask you this, if you were looking around at the other gyms that are available in this area right here of Denver, how would you hope yours is going to differ from those? Well, you know, just focusing on the on the person. You know, there's a lot of great gyms around here. I'm not saying anything bad about them, but they don't have the kind of staff that we have. We're friendly, we're clean, and we've been in the game. You know, I was a professional athlete um, for six years. I fought amongst some of the best in mixed martial arts and in boxing. So I've been there, and we got to cater to the people. Remember, the people are the ones who are paying us. So you got to treat the people right and treat people the way that they that you would want to be treated. So you give them a good product, and they'll they'll come back. You just got done doing a little bit of personal training with a lady I just noticed and uh, she told me she felt extremely comfortable when she worked out in here. She didn't feel intimidated by the gym, didn't feel intimidated by the other people working around her. It actually was a, an inspiration for her. So obviously not everybody who's going to be coming in here is going to be taking this thing on to the pro level or anything like that. But I think there's got to be some kind of benefit working shoulder to shoulder with gentlemen who are actually taking this thing all the way. Sure, I agree with you, Gary, and um, you know, and, and that's the thing. Um, we will have the elite fighters in this gym, but not everyone wants to fight. Not everyone wants to get hit. So you got to cater to the people who basically want to get in shape, and that's like the young lady I was training. And I say young because she's improved a lot. Within within a week, I think she's lost maybe 10 pounds. I guess I spent 60 years of my life gaining weight and getting out of shape, and now it's time to take control. I want to have a wonderful retirement, and health is the number one priority. So getting into shape is what I'm trying to do, and Frankie has greatly helped that. He's shown me that I can push myself a lot farther than what I thought I could. Um, you know, if you, if you cater to the fighters, you might not be in existence for a long time. Um, we will have the elite athletes here, but we got to cater to the community, and we want to make it a better community and a safer community. By doing that is by training these people um, in case they get in tough situations, how to defend them. tremendous amount of weight, and it's been a joy to keep up with the granddaughters and to be able to ride bikes and go swimming with them. And Yeah, he does push you beyond your limits, but he does so in a way that he maintains your dignity uh, he maintains your self-esteem. He gives you great pride in what you're doing and the efforts you're putting forth. And uh, you're not embarrassed at all. Uh, 
he makes it fun and yet it's extremely physical. Um, you know, promoting healthy eating habits, um, self-defense, um, discipline is, is something that um, this gym is going to go after. And, so And to be glowing and feel good about it and walk away, uh, I walk away exhausted, but it's the best feeling of exhaustion. It's not like mopping floors and cleaning your house. It's it's a wonderful, fulfilling, exhausting feeling, and it, it's fun. That's who we're going to um, work with. I also work with a lot of the police officers, the Parker Police, the Denver Police, the Aurora Police. We work with federal agents, so, um, you know, we want to try to... Um, have them in better shape and better knowledge of um, self-defense when they're out on the streets protecting um, protecting our streets for us. Tell me your affiliation a little bit with the um, Cops Fighting Cancer. Well, the Cops Fighting Cancer is a 501c nonprofit that uh, a good friend of mine, Jim Seneca, founded a few years back, and we basically raise money for people, unfortunately, who've got um, struck by cancer and maybe need help and assistance with either food, rent, um, electricity bills. So what we do is we train the athletes here, which are the cops, and we host shows. We put on shows around um, the Denver metro area, and all the money raised goes to the cops fighting cancer. So, you know, it, most everyone knows someone or has had someone in their family um, that's had cancer, maybe passed away with cancer or fighting cancer. So we just try to do our best to uh, let the athletes train here for free uh, that are fighting on our shows. and. Um, we host those events, and um, we try to donate money um, to the to the foundation. Tell me a little bit about your memberships. How do people get involved? Are you guys doing it on a class basis, on a daily basis, on a monthly? How does it work? Yes, we're going to have classes um, anywhere starting from 7 in the morning all the way to 9 p.m. Um, that's going to consist of either CrossFit, cardio classes, boxing, um, youth programs. Um, you know, our, our pricing is very, very affordable, and we work with, we work with people who really can't afford it. Um, you know, anywhere from $50 a month to $140 uh, for all-inclusive, and we also have a great family deal. So, um, you know, definitely come by and see us, and we'll definitely be willing to uh, walk you through the gym. Uh, you'll meet our great staff, uh, the great owners of this place and um, we will um, we'll give you a pricing sheet and then uh, we'll work with you on on the on what we have Basically, uh, like looks like you guys want people to walk in the door and it feel like their gym uh, that's correct and uh, we we are adding some CrossFit stuff we have some chin-up bars and some monkey bars uh, that'll be coming in very short order uh, we want it to be fun we want it to be active and busy uh, we want folks to come in and have a good time in a, in a real low pressure atmosphere What's nice about the gym here, I notice, in comparing to like a 24, which like I say, these, these places are nice and big, but when it comes to the personal touch, working a one-on-one, -on -one, and not only that, but not feeling like a number, basically um, getting the respect that's needed, I think you guys have um, hit a perfect, perfect match here. You know, like I said, again, Parker's a great community, and that's why we, we decided to come to this area. It's, I think it's, it's a tremendous benefit. There's no pretension here. Uh, you don't have to walk in and be an expert. You can walk in as a novice and, uh, and feel perfectly comfortable. Well, you know, we want everyone to know that they, first off, they get a week trial here at our gym for free. And uh, we're going we're gonna to work with them. We're not going to push them um, to their limits right away because, as anyone knows, after you lift weights that first time, you're really sore. So we want to work with you. We're going to take you step by step you know very slow um, I as what I do with my professional athletes I start from how to wrap your hands to how to put on a glove to pop so we're not gonna we're not gonna take you in there and what they say throw you to the woods we're gonna work with you slowly and once you get once you come in and try it you're gonna get addicted to it I'll warn you on that people think you have to devote maybe you know 15 20 hours what do you recommend are they looking at on a daily basis well you know in order to get a good workout you don't need more than an hour because boxing as I stated before is a great workout so the cardio that we do you can get it done in 45 minutes so you come in get a good stretch get your cardio uh, get stretched out and you're heading home so definitely I would I would um, recommend at least three to five days a week fantastic well folks you heard it right there this is Gary Atenzi with CNTV and we put the phone number at the bottom right there as well as our website Come on down if you've been thinking about getting in shape or you've been in shape and want to come to a gym that basically feels like your gym. Basically small enough to be personal but yet big enough to serve you and serve Parker and the surrounding areas. I think you found a great successful formula here. And this is Gary Atencio with CNTV. And if you don't know, well, now you know. <laughs>